it's enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned club kings of Europe? It's Arsenal and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It's Arsenal versus Barcelona. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? is the Arsenal starting 11. Benjamin White plays with Takahiro Tomiyasu in the fullback positions. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. This is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Vinicius Jr. starts alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Erling Haaland. This is it, the Champions League final they are underway. Who will be crowned club kings of Europe? Barcelona losing possession here. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Chance perhaps. The save was a good one. get on the end of this and the header needed to be a lot better than that didn't really make the keeper work really good challenge Kai Havertz Saka oh that's a super piece of defending Cristiano Ronaldo Foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. And he has options available. It's a weighted pass. He's done it! What a moment! The opening goal in this Champions League final. And just look at the celebrations. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it's a comfortable finish in the end which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Erling Haaland.
Here's Ronaldo. Well, it's a very attractive passing sequence. But into the keeper's gloves. Nicely cut out. Closing him down here. Declan Rice. Could be threatening. Saka. Well, the supporters think it's on. Great defending. Mbappe. Cristiano Ronaldo. Barcelona a little wasteful in possession. Jorginho. Arsenal could be onto something. Oh, might be. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Martin Erdegaard. That's a good looking ball. And really going for power. But the opportunity's been squandered. But I'm not sure going for power was the right option. I think that should have been placed into the corner. Time just challenged magnificently. Well, as we've seen, Arsenal have dominated the ball in the last 15 minutes and have been pressing to extend their lead. They just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. over by Messi oh disappointing clearance Christensen it towards goal oh that's top notch goalkeeping you've got to say and the whistle is sounded for half time in this game Second half underway, and Arsenal looking to build upon a largely positive first-half performance. Kylian Mbappe. Holland. Vinicius Junior. An encouraging move from Barca. Not thinking it through. Lewandowski. Messi. Who can he pick out? Oh, really good piece of goalkeeping there. And the goal for Barcelona from the corner here really would change the complexion of the game. Trying to pick out a teammate. And the struggle to get it away properly. Holland. Takes the shot. He's blocked it. Of Lionel Messi. Oh, 
chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Saka. Now with Havertz. Just the challenge that was required. Messi. Here's Ronaldo. Promising move from Barcelona. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. Well, he's certainly been warned, Stuart. No more challenges like that. Well, he's in no doubt now. He can't foul again. to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Saka. Superbly read and executed. Now options are plenty. But quick thinking defensively. Decision goes the way of Barcelona. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Barcelona fighting against this overall situation. What can they pull out of the fire? Five minutes left. Declan Rice. Havertz. Oh, he'll take us on. Well, the goalkeeper is thankful that it wasn't a better effort than it actually was. Jude Bellingham. Now Holland. Messi. Here's Ronaldo. A magical moment for Arsenal fans everywhere. Your old club have just been crowned champions of Europe. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives, and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great thing. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of They'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. Arsenal, the winners of the UEFA Champions League. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. And that's exactly what they're doing. Trotting over towards their supporters to say thank you, a collective effort always on these occasions. Well, what more can you say? They are the best team in Europe. of time and what a great achievement for this club and these are photos